Hi, I'm Mary Beth. I'm a certified diabetes educator, and this is a SNAP insulin pump. Today, I'm going to talk with you about its revolutionary design and how its automatic features can give you less prep time and more lifetime. So let's get started. I'm going to show you a few of the pieces that you'll need for the setup of your SNAP. This is the controller, which houses the electronics of the pump, or what I refer to as the brains of the pump. This is mine that I custom designed to be gray in color. I like gray, it's my favorite. You'll also notice that there are several different color options to choose from. This piece here is called the pump body. It contains all the moving parts that will deliver insulin through the tubing. It is designed to last up to one week and it houses a pre-filled insulin cartridge. The pump body also contains its own battery, which means that you never have to change the battery, purchase a new one, or charge the battery. You get a fresh battery each time you change the pump body. Another part that you will need is the infusion set, or the tubing that delivers insulin to your body. SNAP's infusion set is unique in that it automatically fills the tubing for you. It is different than other pumps. There is no waiting, priming, or rewinding like other pumps require. One of the nice unique features of SNAP is the use of a 300 unit pre-filled glass cartridge. With manual pumps, you have to get this into this at the appropriate amount for two to three days worth of insulin without air bubbles or making mistakes. That is often time consuming and challenging. With SNAP, all of that goes away. One of the things SNAP users love when they experience the setup is how intuitive it is. In fact, in a user study, first-time pump users were able to complete critical tasks 99% of the time after just one training. So let me show you how this works. I simply take my pump body, I remove the white adhesive tab, I take my pre-fill cartridge, drop it into the pump body and push down, and then I wipe the top with alcohol. I then take my infusion set tubing, and as I push down to attach this to the pump body, I will notice that a few drops of insulin appear at the end. This is called the automatic tubing prime, which means that the tubing is already filled with insulin. I then take my pump body, simply attach it to the controller, I'm connected, and I'm all done. One of the most common things you will do every day with your pump is deliver a bolus. Say for example, I'm going to have a yogurt and an apple. I've checked my blood sugar and I start entering it here. Next, I'm going to enter the carbs for my yogurt. If I also want to enter the carbs for my apple, I can add it here and the pump will calculate the total. The pump will show me my recommended delivery dose. I simply press start and the bolus will go. So what we just did there is called a smart bolus. Another helpful feature about SNAP is that it will tell you how much insulin is on board in your body, which means how much insulin is left over from the last bolus you gave. This information is on the home screen of the pump, so it's always available to you. If you're currently taking insulin injections or using a pump, you're familiar with the term basal rate. This refers to the constant small amount of insulin delivered during the day through your pump. You may have several different rates during the day, and this is called a profile. You, along with your healthcare provider, can develop different profiles to fit your lifestyle. When changing your basal rates on SNAP, it's simple. If you're wearing an insulin pump, there will be times during the day that you will need to disconnect, such as for taking a shower or exercise. You can put your pump into stop mode. I now have my pump in stop. Once I want to start my pump, I will get a message that tells me how much insulin I've missed. I can then make a decision if I want to take this insulin as a bolus for better blood sugar control. This feature is unique to SNAP and no other pump offers this option. Like I mentioned earlier, my controller is unique because I designed it myself. Only SNAP lets you choose the look of your pump to fit your unique style. You can choose this color in three simple steps at snappump.com. Let's try it now together. 
On the faceplate, you can choose from three color families, vibrant, subtle, and neutral. I really like charcoal, so I'm going to go with that. Next, on to pick your frame color. Again, you have a variety of options, so try out a few and see which one works best for you. I'm going to pick pink as my frame color. Last, you have the chance to choose whether or not you would like an accent. I think the pink goes well with my design. That's it. Three simple steps and you have a snap pump designed for you by you. Then, each pump is made to order right here in Silicon Valley. Here are just a few samples of what your customized pump could look like. And there are literally hundreds of combinations that you can make your very own. Design your pump today at snappump.com. A lot of people ask me about upgrades simply because they're worried about being stuck with old technology for years, not with Snap. Asante is constantly finding new, innovative ways to make Snap simple and even better. With our easy upgrade program, you can trade in your Snap for $99 to get the latest technology. And don't forget our partnership with Dexcom, which means there are much more exciting things to come. So now you've seen Snap. People tell us it's simple to learn, simple to use, and simple to try. You can try Snap today for your free four-week trial. We give you all the supplies for one month and personalized support from a diabetes educator like myself. Sign up today for your free trial at snappump.com. Ready, snap, go.